The great opportunity today is to look past the immediate problems of the here and now to create images of a better future down the road. I'm Jeff Jower. And I'm Rick Levine for Planet Pulse on this Friday, April 18th. We have the moon in Sagittarius, which always helps us to look into the distance, to look further out. And that can be useful, but sometimes it takes our mind off of what's happening now, and what's happening now is significant also. Well, yeah, I have mixed emotions about this because we're just a couple of days away from this incredibly explosive grand square. The energy's been building all month. And Sagittarius sometimes can use its long-range vision to avoid looking at the here and now, which may exacerbate the problems of the present. But because I think we're in a revolutionary period of time in which answers are not going to be found in the past nor in the present, mm -hmm. that the vision of Sagittarius and the creativity that goes along with this may lift us above the crises of the moment by providing a, a bigger canvas to paint our future on. Yeah, and, and I actually think that, that this Sagittarius moon does do that. It does form a trine with you know Uranus um, in, uh, in Aries, and that fire, fire energy does lift our spirits, and it does allow us to see solutions that may not be the normal same way that we've done it in the past and part of as you've been talking as we've been talking about part of this building grand square between now and in the next few days is about breakthroughs and doing things in new and different ways so i think i agree with you that we can do that today yeah and and one thing that isn't doing things in helpful ways is complaining louder Turning anger, if you have any, into constructive action is a much more healthy way to go. I'm Jeff Jow. And for Planet Pulse, I'm Rick Levine.